Every new release of PTC MathCAD, we improve and enhance existing functionality in the numeric engine. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, the use of multi-threading has been improved and enhanced. The use of multi-threading improves performance by, where possible, computing calculations in parallel. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, multi-threading has been refactored to greatly improve its use and performance. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, if your worksheet contains computations of independent calculable regions, with multi-threading disabled, these calculations may be computed sequentially. Enabling multi-threading may provide you with worksheet performance gains as these calculations of independent calculable regions can be carried out in parallel. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, there are several enhancements to the powerful PDE solve function. The PDE solve function in PTC MathCAD Prime 10 was added in the previous release, and in this release, there are a number of important enhancements that have been made to it. You can now construct a PDE solve calculation using mixed Dirichlet Neumann boundary conditions. The explicit and implicit boundary condition use case has been greatly improved. And use of the PDE solve function in a solve block now supports the use of units. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, there are several general numeric engine improvements. The performance of inline assignment and evaluation with matrices has been greatly improved in PTC MathCAD Prime 10. Evaluating a matrix immediately after assigning it now takes the same amount of time as evaluating it on a new line. The behavior of zeros with units in a matrix with mixed units has been improved. In PTC MathCAD Prime 10, a zero element will only accept units when all elements share the same units, else the zeros will remain unitless. This provides the user a more standardized, clearer result and avoids unit incompatibility issues.